Ooh. Right, good evening everybody. Good evening. Right. It's Thursday. I think it's Thursday, isn't it? This week's flown by. Yeah, it's Thursday, 1st of September. It's the 1st of September. So, I should check that I'm live first of all. Let's check, and I'm sure I am. And then we shall make a start. So we're going to do a few levels of Hangman, and then we shall do some Wordle. So let's check everything's working. Oh, I need to move the picture. Sorry, guys. I was uh, changing a few things around the other day. And that was because I was doing, or going to do, something with HelloFresh. There we go, that's better. We'll keep it on the pink. So I'll wait till people join and then we shall make a start. Let's check the sound. On the pink. Yep, sound is good. So I'll just wait for people to join. Grab yourself a drink. I do like The Hangman, I've got to admit, it is one of my favourite games. So yes, give it another minute or two, 7 o'clock UK time, 2pm Eastern time. So I know a few of you get adverts first of all. Not too loud, am I? I don't think. Hello, Mike. Good to see you. Good evening. Good morning. Good afternoon. <laughs> no ads. No ads for you. That's. It's strange that I don't. I mean, I mean, the only t the only rules I know about the adverts here is that if you watch a replay of mine, which is a replay, you know, not live, and you watch that, you don't get an advert within an hour. I sound muffled. Why do I sound muffled? Can, does does the sound? Let me just check my. One minute. It sounds good to me. Mike, you might have to come out and come back in and see what happens. Good evening, Rick. Hello, Melanie. Good to see you. So, this, is, so you know when I come live here, I do different games, and I think we've all got our favourite game, haven't we? I know Melanie likes Hangman. Rick likes the um, that word's on stream, but that was just too fast, <laughs> other than the maths. Good evening, Jay. Good to see you. I've got your time put down for today. So send me your times, guys, for the 17th of September because I've got a busy few weeks coming up. So, um, well, especially up to the 17th, and I, I don't want to miss anyone. That's why I want to get the times done really early. Um, what was I saying? Yes, yeah, so everyone's got our favourite game, and Melanie's is Hangman. Mike's, I think. Mike, I would say his famous ga game is Wordle. Rick likes Wordle. <laughs> and that word's on stream, but it's too fast. Uh, and we now know that Claire loves the Wordscapes. So Rick likes Wordle as well. So I'll keep doing these games, you know, and we'll keep playing these games, different different games each day. So you at least get one of the games per day. So it is Thursday, which means it's the last day of the week for me. So I might jump on at the weekend though, and maybe play a few games. Um, so, so uh, Mike likes Wordscapes as well. So uh, Melanie likes Wordscapes. You all like Wordscapes. Hello, Dimmy. Dimmy, good to see you. Ah, oh, thank you for the uh, award. So, should we make a start then, guys? Let's do a lag test then first of all. Now, don't forget this game. It's just for fun. So. Let's do a lag test. Put in the in the box the number 60. I want you to put in 60 today. 60. And I'll do a test.
15 seconds for Mike. 18 seconds for Jay. 19 seconds for Melanie. And there's a reason why I put 60. It's because today is Alexis's birthday. So if you've not had a chance to... I know she's coming live in a bit shortly. Um, so... Please do wish her happy birthday. And it was also Anne's birthday, wasn't it, yesterday? And no one told me that it was Anne's birthday yesterday. Completely forgot. I'm really sorry, Anne, if you're there. It wasn't because I went onto Facebook today. And uh, that's what when I saw it. And I was like... Anyway. Right, so let's play Hangman. Let's play Hangman then. Here we go. Don't forget. So you, the rules are you get um, points... Per word, whoever gets it correct gets 10 points, and you all start off with 5 points today. So you've all got 5 points to start with. Here we go then, your first game. Are we going for mix? Yeah, let's go for a mix. We'll go for a mix tonight. So I think she's going out for a meal, went out for lunch, and then she's going to be on and doing, I think she's going to do a Starbucks broadcast on TikTok so please join her I did have the time let me just quickly find the time she did say the time she says she will be live is oh it's gonna be oh well that's that she's five hours behind me so I'm reckoning in the next hour or two hours okay so we'll be within the next two hours Okay, so first word then, guys. We're looking for an actress. First word is eight letters, and second word is five letters. So if you want to give me a letter to start me off. And we're going to start off with... I do, Jay, I do, yes. We're going to start with Mike with an E. Okay, we've got two E's. And Melanie with an A. Two A's. Dimmy says an M. Is there an M? No M, I'm afraid. Good evening, Claire. Lovely to see you. Welcome in. So I'm looking for an actress. First name starts with an A. If you go for the word and you get it correct, you get 10 points. There's been a fly in this room that has been bugging me <laughs> for a long time. Okay, Claire's going for Ariana Grande. Could it be Ariana Grande? Is there an R? Ah, uh, there's no R, I'm afraid. Mel is going for Angelina Jolie. Is it Angelina Jolie? N G L I J and an O. Well done, Melanie. Well done, Melanie. So I'm going to give you 10 points. Actually, so you, you will get five points to start with. So, Melanie, you're now on 15 points. Well done. Right, let's do another. Here we go. We're looking for a movie. So we're 10 points. First word is five letters. And second word is five letters. Yeah, so there's a fly. <laughs> it's been annoying me for the last five days. And it gets to the window, right? And you sort of... The windows are wide open. And you sort of guide it out. It, and it goes out and then it flies back in. It's really weird. It's like it doesn't want to go outside. <laughs> it's the most weirdest fly I've ever, ever known. And it just comes up to me and it just sits there. It's really weird. It just looks at me and... Really strange. Okay, Claire says an O. Is there an O? No O, I'm afraid. 
I'll let you off, Melanie, I'll let you off. In fact, I'm going to be generous today. If you do spell it incorrect, but it sounds the same, I'll know what it means. Okay, is there an L? From Dina, good to see you, Dina. No, oh, what? no L, I'm afraid. No L. Hmm. And also, does everyone know what you're cooking on? Hap I said haps again. <laughs> I do it every time. Does everybody know what they're cooking on the 17th yet? I have not a clue. <laughs> Will it be an autumnal food? I'm thinking I might do. I might try something different. But it all involves like a lot of vegetable. Maybe like a stew or a soup. I don't know yet. Not sure. So send me your letters, guys. So it's t a movie, two words. I think I've got it, you know. I know this sounds strange, but I think I've, I think I've got it. If the first letter is a H. No, it's not. <laughs> I thought it was something else. I thought it was Hocus Pocus. Because that just came to mind. And I was thinking about pumpkins and Halloween and Dina says, yeah, you've officially got a teenager. Yes, I should say if Dina's daughter, Naomi, is it's her birthday today. So I think we should all sing happy birthday for her as well today and for Alexis because it's two birthdays. So after three guys, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Naomi and Alexis and everybody else born September the 1st. <laughs> Maybe I should say for everyone born in September. I don't have to sing it again. Happy birthday to you all. Well done. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Naomi. Hopefully she heard that. Did she hear that or not? <laughs> Okay, Dina says an M. Is there an M? Okay, Alexis is not here at the minute, but I will send every, I'll send her the broad this broadcast to watch back. So how 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 many minutes are we in? Twelve minutes, I think. So I'll tell her that. Twelve minutes in, we sung happy birthday to you. Oh, she's in bed at the minute. Okay. Right. Um. Claire says an R. Is there an R? Ooh, there's three R's. Is there an N? No N, I'm afraid. Ooh, what could it be? I think I've got it. But well, I'm, I'm not playing tonight. I played last night. And the night before. <laughs> Did you all watch the replay back from yesterday? I, I probably not. <laughs> okay, is yeah, you've done Odin, I have another guess. There is actually a sound effect for I think for birthday, I'm not quite sure. I'm not sure if there's a sound effect. If there isn't, I should definitely add one. Which you can use your channel points for to sing happy birthday. I never thought about that. Did I put one up? If not, I will have one ready for tomorrow. Well, not for tomorrow, for next week. It's not in the actual... Um... You've got to click on this little purple icon. Let me just check. Is it Dirty Harry from Mike? Is it Dirty Harry? Have you got the 10 points? D, I, R, T and Y... And A. Well done, Mike. So, Mike, you are on 10 points. Well done. Yes, well done, Mike. Right, next one then. Here we go. We're looking for a dictionary word. And it is eight letters long. So, eight letters Uh, 
I'm just checking my sound alerts to see if there is a... No, there ain't a birthday one. I should have added that. But I'll tell you what I will play. don't know if it's going to... Oh, that's not going to work. Okay, never mind, guys. Right, I'm <laughs> came back to the game. Okay. No worries, Dina. Yep, I'll have a look at that later. Okay. That guy in that movie gives you heebie-jeebies, <laughs> says Melanie. Okay, should we start off then? I'm going to start off with a T. No T. Over to you guys. Well done. Well done. Okay, Manny starts off with an S. Is there an S? No S. Is there an A? One A. Hmm. Right, let's have a drink, guys. Hydration. Stay hydrated. Why is that gone? There we go. <laughs> I feel like everything's running a lot slower today. I don't know if it's just me or not. There we go. I don't always put it up on the screen. There you go, guys. Take a sip of water. Okay, I'm going to have another guess. I'm going to guess a, uh, a P. No P. Melanie says a H. Ah, oh, there's no H. Hmm, I'm, I'm wondering, I'm thinking you're all... Oh, there is a clue. Should we do the clue? Uh, hey, Kukun, good to see you. Um, so dictionary just means a word in the dictionary. But I'm just going to click on the get the clue. What's it say? So it's relating to the Middle Ages. I do like this one, though, with the clues. So it's a word relating to the Middle Ages. I didn't see that because I had my cursor all over the top of the clue button. So if it comes up with a clue and I don't see it, put in the comments, get the clue. Okay, I'm going to have another guess. Let's go for a D. That's one D. Okay, Kukin says an E. Is there an E? Ooh, ah, I've got it. I've got it. Have you got it? First correct answer gets the points. Is there an O? No O. Oh no, actually, yeah, possibly could be, but... Okay, I think I've got it. Kukin says medieval. Is it medieval? M E D I E V A and L. Well done, Kukin. Ten points. So, Kukin, well done. So Melanie, Mike and Kook, and you're all on 15 points. Everyone else is on 5. 
Right, let's do another one then. Here we go. Again, it's a dictionary word. Would you like the clue? Shall I give in fact we'll we'll give it a minute and then I'll give then I'll give you the clue. And this is seven letters. I do like this game though, I do like it. If the words start getting repetitive then I will look for a different game, but it seems to work okay, doesn't it? And Rick says nice. So we'll do this one and then we'll do another a different um, theme. Okay, is there an A? No A. Sorry, Melanie. Is there an N? No N, Kukan, sorry. Having the guess. Right, so I'll give you the clue. I tell you what, I'll only give you the clue when we get halfway. Is there an E? One E. Keep guessing. Is there a D? No D. Right, I'm going to give you the clue. Oh, let's do the H. I'll give you the clue. Your clue is a series of events to produce a result. A series of events to produce a result. No H. Oh. I'm going to go for an S. Ah, two S's. Where are you heading off to, Rick? So it ends in E double S, a series of events to produce a result. Okay, enjoy yourself, have a good time, have a pint for me. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go for a C. One C. So what we'll do, we'll do probably two more hangmans. And then we'll do some word okay? One, two, three. That'll be 50 points for Hangman. And then we'll probably do like three rounds of Wordle. Someone give me a letter. There you go, you've all gone quiet. It worries when you go quiet because I can't, I don't know if we're still live. <sighs> oh, it's okay, I'm yawning my head off again. <laughs> it's probably catching, that's what it is. Okay, Kukin says an R, is there an R? Oh, there's one R. A series of events. To produce a result. I think I've got it. Is there a T? I know there is not a T. 
No, no T. So with anything that you sort of make or something that you produce, it has to go through a. That's your clue. So yeah, it relates. Mike's going for pro. Oh, is it process? Is there a P? And an R. Oh, is it process? Mike, well done. Plus 10 points. And my pen was running out there. Okay. Right, so this is a dictionary word again. We'll just change it. So your next one is... Oh, we're looking for a country. It's a country and it is seven letters long. Well done, Mike. Country that is seven letters long. And we're going to start off with... <laughs> Only ten points. He did last night. I think you had uh, I binned the uh, sheet of paper now, but I think you were it was you were quite high yesterday, weren't it? Was it thirty or forty points? Something like that. But yeah, Mike is currently in the lead with twenty five points. Mel is going for it with Germany. Is it Germany? So I've got to accept your first letter. Is it Germany? If it's not a G at the beginning, then we won't go on for the next letter. No, it's not a G. So keep guessing. Keep sending me your letters. Kukin says, have a great evening, Aiden. Ah, oh, thank you, Kukin. Thank you for joining. Don't forget to share out and follow. Mike's going for an A. Is there an A? There's one A. And Claire says a Y. No Y, I'm afraid. Now they're going for Ukraine. Is it Ukraine? Oh, it can't be Ukraine, but there is a U. So I've got to take just the first letter. Hmm. Time for another drink, guys. Have another drink. Okay, I'm gonna have a guess. I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for a P. No P. Hmm. I know you're all thinking. Okay, Claire says an L. Is there an L? No L. I'm going to go for a D. Ah, we've got one D. Oh man, let's go ads again. We'll just wait until the ads have cleared.
I think I've got it. Yeah, I've got it. I've got it. <laughs> You're going to get it with the R. I'll just give it another five seconds just for the ads for Melody. Okay. Is So, we just waited for you there, Melody. Is there an R? There is an R. Claire's going for Ecuador. Is it Ecuador? E Q U A D. Oh, why is that? Oh, no, it's, it can't be Ecuador. Did I spell that wrong? It's a C, isn't it? Not a Q. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Oh, so I can't accept Ecuador with a Q. Although I did say about spelling tonight, I'm not bothered. I'm going to let Claire have that if it, if it is Ecuador. Because I said at the beginning, I'm not bothered about spelling. Well done, Claire. I shall give you that. I shall give you that. Because I got it wrong. I would have spelt that wrong. So, <laughs> so Claire, well done. Ten points. So we're going to do one more level. You want to give it to Mike? Okay, we'll give it to Mike then. If you're sure, Claire. Okay. Okay, we'll give it to Mike. Uh, Melanie's got adverts again. Oh dear. So we'll just give it. We'll just give it. Get, have a drink, guys. Have a drink. Fifteen seconds. You want to split it? <laughs> All right, we'll split it then. This could change everything. Right, Claire then. Five points. And Mike. Five points. That's right. I was just trying not to confuse myself. So Mike is currently in the lead with 30 points. Claire's on 10. Kukan's on 15. Melanie's on 15. Okay. So don't forget to plus your five. Okay. So your last hangman for tonight. Are you ready? Is a character. And it's three words. First word is six letters. Second is looks like one letter. And third is three letters. So good luck to everyone. But don't forget Wordle. We'll carry on with Wordle and we'll add the points on. But good luck to the last level on Hangman. So who wants to start me off with your first letter? Okay, Claire's going for mother-in-law. So I'll go with the M. Is there an M? If the first letter's not M, then I can't accept the rest of the letters. Okay, so is there an M? No M, I'm afraid. But that would have been a good, good one, a very good one. I thought you had it then, Claire. <laughs> have another guess. Okay, shall we start off with a letter? Let's go for. I'm gonna go for a. I'm gonna go for an I. So there's two eyes. Okay. Okay, is there an O? It's a shame we don't get a clue with these ones. No O. I should put on the screen the scoreboard, shouldn't I?
Okay, I'm going to go for a D. No D. Don't know if you're trying to work out though what, what it is, or you're just not giving me any letters tonight. You're making it difficult. <laughs> okay, I'll have another guess. Oh, Claire says an A. Is there an A? No A. Oh, this is tough. Hmm. I don't know if it's a character from a film or a movie. Okay, is there an N? No N. Keep guessing, everybody. What's that, Melanie says? Bill moaning about noise from quiz. <laughs> oh. Put headphones in, Melanie. Headphones. Rat. <laughs> rat. Rat tenders. Rat tenders. Easy enders. Easy enders. Claire says an E. Is there an E? No E, I'm afraid. Have another guess. Oh, this is tricky. I'm going to go for a T. No T, this is tricky. Mikey, you still there? Is there a U? Oh, there's no you. Last life. If nobody gets it, then it's quite a tough one, though. Nobody gets any points. Is there a Y? Claire, is it a Y or is it game over? There is a Y. Mike says a C. Again. If there's no C, it's game over. Uh, it was Philip J. Fry. Never heard of him. <laughs> right then, so nobody got any points there. So now we're going to move on to... We're going to move on to Wordle. And we're going to go to the UK Google website. And we're going to search for... Um, Wordle Unlimited. Oops. What's it saying there? Let's try again. Wordle Unlimited. Enter. Alright. I can't even see which one it is. There it is. That one, I think. I hope it's this one. And we're going to go for five letter words. It's come up straight away. So again, I'm just going to bring that. I'll have to make it a little bit smaller. Just so you can see the whole text. Is that okay, guys? I'll do it like that. So you can at least see the keyboard and the top word. There we go. Right, so I'm looking for a five letter word just to get us thinking and I want a five letter word any five letter word I will go with tonight don't forget the rules if the letters turn green they're in the correct place if they turn orange they're in the final word but in the wrong place and if they turn dark grey those letters are not in the final word don't forget there might be two of the same letters if or more if they turn green or orange. And we're going to start off with Claire with candy. Oh, it would help if I <laughs> press the right button. Is it? And it's very small. I can't see the text tonight. C A N D Y. Is it candy? It's not candy, but we found a C. 
<coughs> Excuse me. So it's not candy, but we found a C. Don't forget, though, that C is in the wrong place. Now, I forgot to tell you guys, was it yesterday or the day? Yeah, it was yesterday. The, the final word, the final word of Wordscapes was Mela. Was it Mela? M E W. No, sorry, Malay. Malay, something like that. That was the word from Wordscapes yesterday. Oh, thanks, Timmy. <laughs> I have no idea. So we know that there's a C in this final word that we're looking for, but it doesn't start with a C. It has a C in it, but it's not. Doesn't start with a C. Okay, try not to use the N, A, D, or Y. Should we go with... Oh, thank you, Demi, for the, the hearts. It's funny, all this time I've been... Um, when I use my software to stream this out, all this time I've never made the picture bigger. <laughs> I've always had it on a tiny screen, and I've just realised I can make it bigger. I don't have to zip, look right up close to the screen. Right, so we know there's a C, but it's in the wrong place. Let's go with... Ooh. Yeah, I feel that like, like that, do we? <laughs> Um, where's Mike? Mike says he'll be back in a moment. What about my can be place? Um, what about trice? I don't know if that's the word trice. I've got that C in there. Is it trice? Ah, ooh, not trice, but we found an R and an I. But they're all in the wrong place. When did I get emotes? Oh, the emotes, yeah. You can use the emotes if you're subscribed. I do have emotes. Yeah, it was Gemma that did them for me, which was really nice of her. So, yeah, if you do subscribe, you can get access to the emotes. I think you remember you were subscribed to me. I think you were subscribed. Oh, I just heard a bell. Is that I think that means a new subscriber? I think. Ah, oh, thank you, Dimmy Dimmy. You've got them. Did you hear the bell? I have that for new subscribers, so. That was a loud bell, wasn't it? I've never, I've not heard that before. So, thank you so much, Dimmy, for subscribing, and thank you for gifting me your subscription to Melanie as well. That was really nice of you. Yeah. So, if when you subscribe, you get access to the emotes, and you can use those on other people's broadcasts. <coughs> Excuse me. Right. So we've got an R and I and a C. Um, so we need to use those letters. Oh yeah, could it be brick? That's a good one, Claire. Oh, it can't be brick because of the the R. So they're in the wrong place. The R, the I, and the C are in the wrong place. But on this occasion, I'm going to go for it just to see if we've got a K and a B. Okay, so there's no B and there's no K, but. The I, the C, and the R are in the wrong place. Hmm. <clears throat> Quite tricky, this one.
Hmm. Come back, Mike. <laughs> It's funny because it's got Rick. <laughs> Where's Rick gone? <clears throat> but it doesn't have... It's got R-I-C, but they're in the wrong place. Um, Mike's back. We need your help, Mike. So we just tried to eliminate two letters, like the B and the K, because we couldn't think... Any guesses? Hmm. What about riced? Riced? Oh, I can't have rice. There's no E and D. Mm. Could it be? Mm, it can't be trick. I think I might have got no. Oh, actually, no, no, it can't be. Mike says an M. Um. What about oh, this is tough. I don't know. Barrick. Not Barrick, but we found an R and an I in the right place. Mike says choir. Could it be choir? That's a good one. Is it? Oh, it can't be choir because of the C at the beginning, Mike, but we'll go with it anyway. Is it choir? No. Really tough tonight. <clears throat> Hmm. I think so. The second word, second letter, must be a C. Blank C R I. Blank C R I. Hmm. Tough, really, really tough. <laughs> Is it script? That's a good one, Mike. Is it script? R I P and R is it script? Mike, well done. 
And you just got yourself 10 points. So, we're going to do one more. Let's see how easy this one is. If it's too easy, then we'll do another one. It's going to be worth 10 points. Okay. Here we go then. Look, we're looking for a five-letter word. Any five-letter word? Yeah, well done, Mike. That was really good. I would, would not have got that. I'm just going to find out what time Alexis is live. So any five letter word? Shall I choose a word for a change? Let's go, f oh we're going to go for, we'll go for clove. Is it clove? No, not clove. But we found an O. <sighs> Excuse me. It's a great game, this, isn't it? <laughs> it just uh, definitely... You've got to think about it. I think for us at this time of the night, it's kind of, we like to, it's okay for first thing in the morning, but on an, on an evening for me, it's, I can't think at this time of night. I'm much better at it in the morning. Hmm, shall we go with... I'm going to go for... No, it can't be. Um, hmm. Yeah, it's only 18. I just looked at the temperature, actually. It's not too bad. It's a bit, a bit cooler now. But still, I think we're going to have a storm on Monday. I'm going to get a okay. curve. Or it might be next week, I can't remember. Now, guys, I won't be on next Thursday, okay? So next week will only be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I won't be on on the Thursday. But I might possibly come on on the Friday. Um, what is this word? <laughs> Let's go for... Hmm. Let's go for horse. I know it's not going to have the E at the end, but just to get us... Horse. Ah, you see, that was a good move. So we know it starts with a H. There's an O and an R, but they're in the wrong place. Any guesses? <clears throat> Very tough. I think we we need a drink. <laughs> Cheers everyone. Drink time. So we know it starts with a H. Could it be 
Oh, I've got one. Could it? I know there's no year. I was going to go for hurry. <clears throat> Can't be hurry. Okay, no, it's not going to be there, but maybe Hoover. Again, just a word to get us moving. Ooh, it's not Hoover, but we found the R at the end. So it's H blank 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 R, but H. <clears throat> Actually, we know the the fourth letter is an O. H blank blank O R. So H blank blank O R. Oops. H blank blank O R. <coughs> Excuse me. Coughing a bit tonight. Any guesses? That is a good one, Mike. Is it humour? Is it humour? For the win? Is it humour? Mike, well done. You are tonight's winner with... Do you want to know your score? 10, 20, 30, 40, plus the 5 for half the points, and another 5 for being here. you got a grand total of 50 points. Well done, Mike. Okay, um, Melanie, 15 points, Kukan, 15 points, and Claire with 10 points. So, and everyone else with 5 points. So, well done everyone, thank you all for joining, and I shall be back on Monday. Actually, I might come on at the weekend, maybe, but if not, it will be on Monday with your quiz. But it won't be as, it won't be as um, packed as it was last Monday. So thank you for subscribing, everybody. And uh, don't forget, this month is the last month on Patreon. So I'll still upload the videos. Um, but I won't be uploading every single one as of the 1st of October. Um, so thank you for joining, guys. I shall see you on Monday. Have a really good day, guys. Thanks for watching. See you soon.